My chimpy was big, but this one is beyond belief. It's for the it's flu the least one can say. I've been longing for a warm fire for ages. Since I set foot on the island, I haven't ventured more than two yards away from it. Have you also just arrived? Oh, late morning, I'd say. Louis, come join us. Monsieur, may I introduce you to Monsignor His Eminence, Cardinal Piaggi? He joins us straight from Rome. Oh, just call me Your Eminence. It's simpler. George Washington, President of the United States of America. Delighted at last to make your acquaintance, Mr. President. Pleased to meet you, Mr. President. Louis Moras de Richer. Mm -hmm. It is an honor to meet you. Young man, let's keep it simple, please. Let us forget Ugh. our fancy titles. I don't, I don't want to look at his face. You, Louis. I should imagine you never thought you'd be in such company. I must admit that I didn't. I was hoping it's I the first be time that I've ever met so many illustrious now. personalities. And you haven't seen anything yet. Generally, when Lord Mortimer organizes one of his receptions, that, he just looks there are over a dozen people here. They can't all be here yet. And you'll see, most of the time, there's only the upper crust. And I noticed you were already getting to know his eminence at the entrance. It's the perfect place to build up a network. What were you talking about, if you forgive my indiscretion? Mm. Let's go down At the risk of disappointing you, we weren't conspiring in our corner, sir. His eminence was simply telling me that he knew my mother and how much he held her in high esteem. It so happens that Monsieur de Ricci's mother is to join us. Oh, pity. No scrumptious gossip or juicy tidbits, unmentionable secrets, or mm. even money matters. But you'll see, it will come. Despite all the goodwill in the world, you can't stop people scheming left and right around oh. here. Speak for yourself, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Well, what my is friends, holding up her dress? Do any of you know the reason why we're here this time? Not in the slightest. As for me, I've been invited by Sir Horn, a close friend of Lord Mortimer. But uh, I do not know the reason why. You see, Louis, every time Lord Mortimer organizes a reception, he always finds a moment to set up a chat with all the guests. During which time we remake the world. Accompanied by gallons of absinthe and cussing, I'll leave you to imagine the result. So, sweater. if I understand rightly, Monsieur de Richer, in the back of your you dress, you come out here to join missing. your mother. For what reason exactly? Uh, let's. That's not true. Lord Mortimer asked me to drop everything. I don't think it's like my mother, who seems to secret. have disappeared during her stay here. Oh. I took the first boat, and here I am. I'm so sorry. Don't be, sir. It's not your fault. Seriously, though, I know your mother well. Stay behind with me afterwards, and we'll take a moment to speak about her. Oh, God, I don't want to be that close to you. Good Lord. Let's... Washington is wearing the emblem of the Grand Master of the Golden Order. It's the highest distinction of the order in the United States. It puts him on par with my mother. He must really know his stuff Why? when it comes to the occult. The ever loving fuck are you wearing a Good giant... evening, my friend. <sighs> Shit. That's the man for my vision. <laughs> An urgent case Ooh. has delayed our host, Lord Mortimer. He's... He can't be present this evening, and he sends his a deepest little apart. heavy with the powder. He's asked me here and he hasn't even turned up. Great start. Um Do you know that man? Sir Gregory Holm, an English aristocrat. Very influential. He's also close to Lord Mortimer, so don't be surprised if he acts like he's at home. And now, my dear guests, a light meal is served in the small salon. For those who would like to, you're invited to follow me into the next room. My dear fellow, you must have read my thoughts. I shall follow. We'll have to be careful not to make too much noise. One of Lord Mortimer's guests is relaxing. Oh, we shall be quiet. Don't take it the wrong way, Sir Holm, but I have already eaten. Thus, I shall be happy to remain by the fireside. Mm -hmm. If you don't mind, Gregory, I should like to keep Mr. Washington company. Please feel at home. And you, sir? If I stay with Washington, we'll be able to speak about my mother. But on the other hand, I'd like to learn more about this home. I saw him in my vision. 
I don't think I'm going to learn uh, much about Holm because he's going to be talking with Piaggi, I think. So I'm going to stay with Washington. Let's see what Washington has to say. Even though I feel like it's going to be a big mistake. Sir, if you don't mind, I shall stay here. Do exactly as you please, young man. Louis, thank you for staying. Just like you, when I arrived this morning, I found out that Sarah had gone missing. I know your mother well. Don't worry, Emily is from the English branch of the Golden Order. And President Washington is in fact the leader of the Order in the United States. I, I didn't know. Sorry to have made you wait, but I didn't want to speak in front of the others. You did well. Secrecy and discretion are the pillars of our organization. I'm sorry, you're wearing a if big I can ass help fucking in any him. way at all. Please necklace, don't hesitate your, to your ask, my lad. And if you have any other questions, now's the time. He's not being secretive or discre discreet. Um. His mother has always had a fascination for Lord Mortimer, but has never wanted to tell me why. Lord Mortimer is a remarkable man. He's wealthy and is advisor to the very highly placed. Your mother is the head of the order in France. It doesn't surprise me that he asked her to come. Lord Mortimer greatly contributed to financing my electoral campaign, for example. Mm. But I want this to be clear without ever seeking to gain an advantage. <laughs> and that is to his credit. Yes, you can trust him. He will do everything in his power to help you find Sarah. Mr. Washington, you seem to be very familiar with my mother. Uh, when did you, when did last, you last, last speak to her? Philadelphia, 15 years ago. Jesus. Sarah often went back and forth between what France really? and the United States. Yes, I remember those days. I didn't see her too often. Right. Would it be too much if I asked you a few more questions? Not at all. Go ahead. But I can't promise I'll remember everything. May I ask, mm -hmm. when you saw each other, what did you talk about? So, my mother was with Exhausted. You're- you just encountered one immunity. Effort point is locked. Use the golden lecture to cure yourself. During the American Revolution, mm. did you talk about politics? Yes. Okay, so he's Despite immune to politics. Young age, she defended our cause with enthusiasm. Did she go to the front line like your famous gunner, Molly Pitcher? Yes, in a way. The role given to women in your war was a great step forward. Lee, I am impressed. Few people know about the legend of Molly, so you don't know the true story. Molly Pitcher is a character invented by Sarah. She persuaded me to use a heroic female figure, an American Joan of Arc, if you will. Mm. It enabled us to gain a few thousand extra <laughs> fighters, and it was all thanks to your mother. I, I, I didn't know that. Thank you, sir. I was hoping to speak with Lord Mortimer. At least now I have some information, thanks to you. I repeat, Lord Mortimer is a man of his word. You won't be disappointed. And I am persuaded that your mother's research is his main concern. Mm, she has left the island. The other order. Mother still is at the head of the Golden Order. I find it difficult to believe that she came to this island without notifying the other members. Yes, yeah, especially in myself. I did not know. I am here at the request of Sir Holm, it's a situation regarding the Crown of England to resolve, and to see what Lord Mortimer has to propose to us. As for me, Lord Mortimer asked me here to speak about the future of America. I did not know that your mother would even be oh, among yeah, us. Oh yeah, that I believe. I believe you in are any completely case, clueless. No one has yet mentioned us. And useless to me. We haven't found many clues yet. And stupid, because you have that fucking thing around your neck. Um, I shall have a book. But I did find a book that belongs to my mother. Where did you find it? That's what worries me. I found it hidden on the wharf. Do you think she was preparing to discreetly leave? I don't know. An extremely likely proposition. 
I'll believe it when I see it. I can trust them marginally more than I can everybody else. I'm sure nothing bad is happening. My mom is like high up there for trust. I hope not. But these, I'm kind of leaning towards giving a little bit of trust to. Careful, they're coming back. Well, I am impressed with all this splendor. But don't spend too much time with Mr. Washington, my dear, or you'll lose your pretty accent. <laughs> I already lost mine. You seem to be intrigued by that statue. Absolutely. It is remarkable. Lord Markable is ugly. fond of atypical works of art. Mm, I won't disguise the fact that I find it all a little megalomaniacal. Thank you. But I must say, Thank you. he does have some outstanding pieces. Mm. So, who was that young lady with you? Elizabeth Adams, Mr. President. She would have liked oh, to stay with us, right but there. the poor thing is exhausted. Gross. Elizabeth Adams? Miss Adams is here to rest. You have perhaps already come across her in the corridors. Mm -hmm. She arrived a few days ago. I perceived her, but we weren't introduced. Rest assured, she is not here for the same reasons as yourselves. Consequently, I'm counting on your indulgence. Okay. Washington looks surprised, but Holm doesn't seem to see it. I wonder if he's being polite or if he really doesn't see his discomfort. On that note, it's very late. You must be exhausted. The servant will accompany you to your rooms. I'm not sure what that really revealed. Ladies, gentlemen, I bid you all good night. Mr. President, your eminence, Duchess, you have the same rooms as usual. You, Monsieur de Richet, will find your room at the end of the corridor. Mm -hmm. Well, my friends, I am bone tired. I am off to my bed. See you in the morning. Good night, sir. I shall do likewise. Louis, I shall see you in the morning. Sleep well. Good night. See you tomorrow. Kind of seems like a shame oh, she dressed man. up like that. It's been quite a day. Nothing happened. Right. Where is my room? Okay, so I'm not gonna go to my room yet. I'm gonna just look around. Let's see. Uh, anything over here? I just want to make sure that I'm not missing it. Just walk down this area. Is anybody on one about? I'm not gonna say anything. Sir Jacques Peru. He can speak French with an accent, but he can't speak English with a French accent. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> it's just... Uh, what's this? A few leaves out of an old encyclopedia. Mm -hmm. Golden elixir. It cures all your negative alterations. You cannot carry more than five. I'm not gonna bother with it. I don't think we're gonna need it. And I'd rather save it because I think we're done talking to people. The quorum guide. Mm hmm. Anything right here? No, no, no. Alright. Oh, do these. Nope. Now, Devil's Thorn. 
It looks like that book isn't important. Can't go that way. Of course not. Okay. What's through there? Somebody's room. Monsieur Johann von Wunder. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, another coin. Keep an eye out. The coin. An important book. Just dropping coins everywhere. Go like Sonic. I don't know if that was an appropriate comparison. Yes. Royal jelly. I think I'm full of royal jelly. Ah, saw it. Coins. Um, anything in here? Monsignor, His Eminence Cardinal Piaggi. Mm hmm. Oh, I heard that. I heard it. I heard it. I'm picking up whatever I can find. That's mine. Just want to be sure I grab everything I can. Oh, you keep the nice, safe paintings in here, huh? Oh. Duke Manuel Godoy. Okay. Dr. Coin. I think this is where we started. Duchess Emily Hillsborough. Yeah, this is where we started. Alright, let's go to our room. Was something going? No? Okay. I'm, I'm gonna get very paranoid. Alright, let's go in. Oh, this is right. a long episode. So what shall I do with this letter? It might be about my mother's disappearance. But if I open it, uh, I'll be betraying Biagi's trust. What should I do? I don't think it's going to be about her disappearance, because he already told us it was a list of names. So let's just leave it alone. Damn. Can't wait to open it, but I gave my word to Piaggi, so... 
Too bad. Just I'll wait until I hand it to mother. That looks wow. really useful. Nice room. Mortimer sure doesn't do things halfway. It's very big. I, I will say I do like the room. Let's, let's just look around, see if there's anything to see or find. I can't get that. Okay. Can go outside in a second. Inferno by Dante. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Lovely lectures Mortimer is giving to his guests. Very jolly. Okay, can't open that. Saint Francis of Assisi in ecstasy, before superior voices. It always amuses me to see how art gets used for propaganda purposes. The conversion of Saint Paul by Caravaggio. It's incredible. It doesn't look like a copy, but I was sure the original was in Rome. What is that? Is that someone laying on the ground and then set up? I can't see what that is. That's too dark. Saturn devouring his son again. What the fuck? Same came in the hall. I wouldn't like to be his son. Why do you? Why would you put this in my room? I, I'm like you have two of these. Two versions of the same type of painting, or rather, two pa two paintings of the same uh, depicting the same event. That's creepy. Saint Jerome and the Angel. Why are you so interested in yet again art with political undertones? Eating their sons of a saint, hearing voices. Judith beheading Holofernes. Ironic in a way. When you know that the artist represented herself as Judith beheading her mentor, who had raped her. Uh huh. Carmelite water uh, gives you a focus. Say your next goal will cost no effort. Okay, that's cool. All right. Go outside. What's out here? Can't do anything here. Okay, hello, floating books. Okay, I can't get the floating gel, the gel, uh, the jelly, royal jellies. Um. Okay, nothing important. Okay, I don't want to go in any anything yet. A Chinese coin. A ruble. Hmm. I'm just finding everything right here. Okay, let's go in here. Um, the torture of Ixion, condemned by the gods to lose his mind because of his arrogance. Oh, that's rightly disturbing. More overall jellies. Oh, I can't look around anymore. Bummer. Okay. Let's see. Ooh, okay. Success. No failures. Awesome. We went to the manor, but we're okay. Yeah. No alternative paths was we could have talked to Sir Holm and met someone unexpected. I'm assuming they're talking about Adams. Miss Adams. Alright. Emma. Ooh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. 
All right. Ooh, we got eight point. Dang, eight points. Hold on a second. Oh, 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 oh. My back is hurting a lot. <sighs> okay. So, psychology. I only need one point for manipulation, so I'm gonna get manipulation. We saw some stuff that could be used for subterfuge, which could be important. So let's get that. Um. Okay, I'm gonna get one for science, and then one in occult. Oh. I don't want to get vigilance, but we don't have enough for enough. But we're close to a cult in there. And agility. Oh, I think that's not super important. Um, I have a feeling a cult is going to be important eventually. And science, we've already come across stuff that has to do with science. So, yeah, I'm I'm gonna go with these and go with that. We're just gonna go with that. Um. And just get that science one. Right. Another vision. Okay, so home in. Your okay. turn. Okay, that's. The servants are not very efficient. Durache can't be far away. They'll find her soon. Their search time is restricted, given that they must keep an eye on Adams. I can take care of her, you know. Yes. Well, in any case, I do thank you for bringing her to the island. From what I've understood, the search of de Richet's room hasn't turned up any results. Not yet, no. But we've put her son in there. Perhaps he'll find something. Mm. Mm. That might come in handy. Louis grows impatient at not yet having met the famous Lord Mortimer. He will meet him tomorrow. Oh, what a pity to lose a knight at the start of the game. Are you waiting for someone? A young French soldier. During our game of chess. Napoleon? Don't worry, Gregory. The I game see his thingy. He's a soldier. Yeah. I'll have one of my men escort you back. Don't trouble yourself. I know my way out. Ah, good evening, gentlemen. Please forgive mm. me for this late hour. It is never too late. And we have much to discuss. That is a horrible, like, hairdo. Don't worry, our games always seem to end like this. Or always start like this. Come, come, take a seat, my friend. That was... Petty. But okay. Okay. Nighttime stroll, Mr. President? There's nothing like it for a good night's sleep. Do not hesitate to ask a servant to show you back. The corridors seem quite safe. Peppermint, lime flower, and valerian. My miracle remedy when one can't get to sleep. A very good night to you, Mr. President. Thank you. And to you too, sir.
Oh, he came into our room? Okay. So... Okay. So that was a current vision. So does that mean... What is that? Okay. Dear Monsieur de Richet, please excuse me, but I am unable to join you at present. However, rest assured that we are doing all we can to resolve the case that concerns us. By the way, enclosed, you will find a key that will enable you to retrieve the personal effects your mother left behind. Yours faithfully, Lord William Mortimer. Inspiration of St. Matthew, or Matthew writing his gospel, dictated to him by voices. The last judgment. Why do I always get the most terrifying room? Yeah, he he's giving you like a shitty room. Incredulity of St. Thomas. Why is Caravaggio representing St. Thomas putting his finger in the wound? Thomas looks on but doesn't touch. Golden elixir. Huh. Inferno by Dante. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Lovely lectures Mortimer's right, giving to his guests. Here. Very jolly. Okay. Excuse me. Am I bothering you? Uh, no. No, not in the least. You just woke me Is up from a sleep. I'm going to need your help. Do you remember the young lady we spoke of in the hall? Yes. Elizabeth Adams. Elizabeth, okay. Home introduced her to us. Yes. Well, she is the daughter of my friend, the Vice President, John Adams. But she is supposed to be dead. Yeah, that's bizarre. Fair enough. Good heavens. I was present at her funeral. It, it is disturbing mean... indeed. Yes. I need to make sure it's her. That's where you come in. I want you to distract Elizabeth while I search her room. And perhaps get my hands on some important information. At least, I hope so. Elizabeth is in the small salon. If you hurry, you can still catch her. I just need ten minutes. But if my vision is true, there are two men nearby discussing very important issues, and one of them looks much like Mortimer. Washington is very kind, but I came to this island for my mother, not for his ghost stories. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go with my vision because. Mm, yeah, we're sir, go with my vision. I, I don't feel well. I'm going to have to decline. I see. Well, I hope you won't be needing my help one day. Fuck you! He I just said he didn't me. feel well. I'll search my room later. <sighs> All of a sudden, you're like, oh no. You're being stingy. Okay. Um. Oh, Louis, the other way. You're straying from your objective. The other way, okay. I recognize this part of the corridor. I'm close. Okay. Hold on. <sighs> Locked. Servants change the beds every day. There must be a service key somewhere. Service key. Let's not use up. Service key. Sir, I'm sorry, but an important meeting is underway. My instructions are to let no one pass. Okay. There was key. Hmm. Servants put clean laundry here. The service key. I was right. All right. Well, let's let's talk to this um, servant guy and see 
Wait, this is Napoleon's place, okay? Tell me, my good man, sir. Um. Hold on. Hold on. What? I want to be able to use that, but I don't have. What was the one? The Carmelite water? Four. Uh, four. Let's use a scarab. Let me through. I'm in a hurry and they've already begun. Sorry, sir, but no one is permitted to enter. First, you delayed me at the dock. Then, at the buffet, you spilled red wine all over me. Then, you put my luggage in the wrong room. It, it wasn't me, sir. Don't try to trick me with the mask like last year. You've taken a dislike to me, and I don't know why, but it's too much. Let's pay a visit to Sir Holm right now. I beg you, sir, please enter. My apologies, and I hope the rest of your stay will prove satisfactory. Mm, I'm wondering if that's gonna bite me in the ass. Hannibal crossing the Alps. Another military success. Why do I get nothing but visions of horror in my room? And he gets victory after victory? The Battle of Alexander. Yeah, Jesus that is weird. Lord, how Alexander the Great triumphed over King Darius. Yet another one with delusions of grandeur. The Prince by Machiavelli. A perfect read for anyone with a surfeit of ambition. Okay. Mm, that might come in handy. That was a weird angle. Oh, so he's immune to politics. Well, that's understandable. Buy corn decorated with a cockade. It must belong to a French soldier. It's a beautiful weapon. Levy damask blade. It's marked with the initials of the manufacturer in Versailles. And my dearest son, I'm writing to inform you to act quickly. The situation is rapidly worsening here. Powelli continues to steer our motherland, Corsica, toward open warfare between France and England. His men are everywhere. We are obliged to go into hiding and are unable to remain in the same place for more than two days. I wouldn't be surprised if they targeted us soon. Make haste, my son. You hold our destiny in your hands. Your loving mother, Maria Letizia Bonaparte. I can't search that. Right. Oh, I can't hear anything here. I've got to find another spot. Okay. Anything over here? Real quick? No. I think. Okay. This window opens onto the balcony. Um, okay, hmm. so that means the other room must be on my right. <sighs> Sir, I understand your eagerness, but the pressure on my family complicates the task. Relax, my friend. Your relatives will soon be huh. safe. So what I saw in my vision really did happen. <sighs> well... I hope I haven't missed anything important. I thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Don't mention it. Now that's settled, let us speak about your support. Yes. You mentioned earlier some assistance from the Golden Order? Absolutely. I have concluded an agreement with their leader, Lady Sarah Faustine du Richet. Another case that Mother didn't tell me about. The funds from the Order will finance the building of a foundry in Tuscany. You will soon be able to count on a hundred or more cannons for your future campaigns. I... I was not expecting so much help from you. Uh, when can I meet this uh, de Richet? Well, unfortunately, something has cropped up. De Richet has disappeared. Disappeared? What? Here? Yes, but the staff are redoubling efforts to find her, I assure you. So the agreement, is it on or off? It is on. Her right-hand man has just arrived here to help us find her. And oh, so you're going to make agreements with, Louis Maurras with de me? Richet. 
without Hope talking to him? He will ensure his mother's commitments are met. Louis, not an easy name to live with in these times. Uh, of course, mm. but from now on, you will deal with him. This man it can only be Mortimer. Who the Very fuck well. do you I think you are? Him out. My mom is the head of the order, and you're trying to act like I'm your fucking servant? Ooh, I don't like this guy. Mortimer, I don't like him at all. Oh, crap. Well, I better get away from here. Yeah, leave. Which room are you in? Oh, this is Emily's room. Ooh, Emily's about Lily? What? Emily? Uh, up. Okay. I can explain. Perhaps, but remains. Okay, disconcerted. Someone threw you off balance. The cost of effort, cost of effort points increases when using your skills. Ah, oh, great. Use a golden. <laughs> okay. Hold on, what is the golden elixir? That's two and okay. But but first you could perhaps remove the blade no. from my throat. You have ten seconds to explain your presence here. Um let's try to calm her down. Emily, we both know you're not going to kill anyone this evening. Be careful. I might have to cut you off. Wait. <laughs> let's talk about this misunderstanding. Okay. What are you doing yes. in my room? Um, psychology. Are you sure? First of all, let's keep calm. My being here is just a coincidence. Anyway, oh, I seriously doubt vulnerable. what I'm doing in your room is really the question that interests you. Um, no, is it? Clever boy. So answer the question that does interest me. What were you really doing on the balcony? Uh, worry. Seeing the window open, I feared someone had entered your room. With what I've heard next door, I had every reason to believe that your life was in danger. I am a grown woman, but how kind of you to worry about me. Now that I'm like safe Emily. and sound, tell me more. Do these events concern me? Do they involve the Golden Order? Um. Talk about your mother. Let's go about that. more, I get the feeling that something serious has happened to my mother. So if disturbing your sleep in the middle of the night helps me find her, I have no regrets. Yeah. That is the most sincere thing you have said to me since we began. All right, Louis, I okay. might have overreacted a bit. Please do excuse me, but next time, please try knocking on my door. I'd be delighted to open it for you. Oh, well, I'll remember in that case. Good night, Emily. Good night, Louis. Oh. Mm, she's looking mighty fine, I'm just saying. You got some curves. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let's just go back. Your Eminence, what are you doing here? Mm. I wanted to speak to you about something important. Do you still have my letter on you? The one I gave you in the home? I Why do you ask? I have a name to add to it. Here it is. Thank you, my son. Ah, I see that it's still sealed. I was right to put my trust in you, Luis. Now give me one second, please. I can't imagine what would have happened if I hadn't added this name to the list. Please, be sure to give this letter to Sarah the moment you see her. You can count on it. Have a good night. Yeah, now we can look at it, because he just tested us. Fucking sus. Alright, we're... There he is. Can we go back to it? I'm exhausted. 
better go to bed. No, I'll search my room tomorrow. If Mother stayed here right before me, you never know. And Mortimer had better show up. Okay, so no fails. We could have talked to Washington and prevented a violent confrontation. Mm. But we succeeded. Found what we needed to know. Good. Okay, so we got four points. Um. So far we've had to use, we've come across agility a couple of times and vigilance and I really want to get the sciences uh, okay let me look at my inventory and see if I got anything for science no mm. I don't want to use science yet. Agility, though, it would come in handy. I'm gonna put two in there. But the great thing is, we could have done it for. We could have gotten two just right there, I guess. But let's. Vigilance. Maybe. I want to spread the love a little bit because we're gonna get more and then the next time we get more we can just pop 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 and pop and we get three right there um so yeah we're just gonna go with that vision yesterday I saw that mother had this room before me I better search the room who knows maybe she left me something behind oh I can equip a manuscript okay um let me check the character Manipulation it cost a lot. Etiquette, diversion, and conviction. Um, I feel like it's better to use manipulation because it takes more. That means less I have to deal with later on. Okay, yeah. Let's go with that. Oh, jelly. I haven't even had time to unpack my cases. There's that letter. Writing material. Mm -hmm. We need to get vigilance. I don't think anything's going to be outside, because we already checked outside. Um, what was the key for? Is it for this? There's a circle around the lock here. Must be the trunk Mortimer was talking about. 
The key should open it. Use the unlock. Mm hmm. There's a note. Effects of Sœur de Richer to be given to her son, Louis. I should probably take it. I have no space left. I'll retrieve it later. Okay, what? That's someone sticking a hand in a wound? Why are they... Okay, more and more? Three. There's three of these fucking things. Three of them. There's that one, there's that one, and then there's the one in the hall. What is going on with the Saturn? I am really getting some crazy vibes here. Why would you put all those in my room? Oh, this bookcase um, is well stocked. It's just a oh, lot of this gore. Book has been put in back this the wrong room. way round. And it's disturbing me. A voyage around the world. The travel log of the explorer Louis Antoine de Bougainville. Mm -hmm. One of mother's favorite books. What a coincidence. And I don't believe in coincidences. It's just too much. I don't know what's going on here, but if you felt threatened, I'll bet you'd leave a clue, wouldn't you, mother? Found it. A faint sign of the order, barely visible. Mother, you undoubtedly must have hidden a clue in this book. Let's see if I can find anything else in this room. Okay. I'm not far from solving the puzzle, I must keep searching. Look, markings on the floor. This? Uh, that was a drag just a markings. bit worn out. I no. was hoping to find something leading to a secret passage. No, that's drag markings. Hold on. It's a secret door that you can get to somebody's room. Isn't it Piaggi next to us? Amber crystals. Okay, hold on. We got. Amber fragment. What was it about? Amber? It was about Amber, right? Oh, okay. An effort point. Oh. Okay. These are twice. Okay. Um. Hmm. Nothing here. I wouldn't mind a nice, strong coffee, though. Vigilance, and I don't have it, and I'm really fucking annoyed. I haven't even had time to unpack my cases. Maybe it's outside? I don't... Here's something will undermine my botanist appreciation for the local climate. Hmm. Let's recap. My mother was in this room. I found a rare edition of her favorite book. She must have left something behind. 
She must have used the writing materials. What if she used lemon juice instead? An old trick used to hide messages. A message using invisible ink. I bet she used a lemon to leave a message. Now, how do I reveal the message? Okay. Also this. Let's just try it. I'm not gonna waste my point on it. I watch it. message. Let's see what my mother wrote. Where all eyes size you up, you must pass by the Gorgon. Gorgon was the name of Medusa in Greek mythology. On the other hand, where all eyes size you up, I don't get it. And judging by the number of paintings in the manor, could be anywhere. After that, she adds, beware hero. The beast always charges the best protected soldier. And that's its weakness. What is my mother trying to tell me? Since you've gone to so much trouble, you must not have only found something important, but you must have also felt like you were in great danger. Now I'd better hurry and find that damn Medusa. Mm-hmm. Sir, dinner is served in the Red Salon. Typical. I'm not hungry. Please give my apologies to all the guests. Uh, Sir Holm requests your presence, sir. Well... I guess I'm just gonna have to wait before going <laughs> and looking for my Medusa. His Tell him I'll be face. there in a minute. Like, oh. All right. So. Ooh. Nice. I already got that up. I need to get science. So now we don't have to worry about that. He will get us that. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's good. Rely on your knowledge of myths, occult, and religious symbols, as well as ancient languages and secret societies. Great. Okay. I'm going to end it here. Uh, it's going on one o'clock uh, in the morning here, and I'm still going to have to edit this later. And I do have to record tomorrow as well, because I do want to record some more videos for the week. I'm getting tired. Uh, so far, I've been liking this. I mean, it's really hard to stop. <laughs> it really is hard. I really want to go back and do some more. Uh, so I might play some more tomorrow. Let me know how you like it. Uh, if you do like it, please, please give it a like. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button down at the bottom and that notification bell for updates on whenever I do uploads. And my Twitter is down in the description. All right, this has probably been cut up all to hell, like maybe four episodes, um, 30 minutes each, because it's going on two hours now. Um, Sorry about that, but it really was hard just to stop. I didn't want to like cut the mission off and I didn't know where a good part would be. Um, this is actually a really good game. This is a good game, except for this is going to be the last time I mention this. His voice is grating to me. It's grating to sit here an American accent when you're surrounded by a lot of foreign accents because the the tonation tends to be very fluent and soft and just it's different and then all of a sudden you have this flat american accent just barging your its way in and you're like especially when you have a flat american accent using a parisian or french pronunciation of words i'm just like 
mind blown. I, you know, I don't know what to think. I don't know why this is. I'm probably gonna actually have to research this. Um, why they decided to do with this, uh, go with this voice actor, or why this voice actor decided it was a good idea to go with an American accent. Ugh. <sighs> I know that I'm harping. I know that I'm harping and you're probably tired about it about it by now and and I promise this is gonna be the last time I'm ever gonna mention it because I, I just I feel like I need to get my ranting over with. Like I need to get it out of my system before I just let it go and just like have to suffer with it. Yeah, if you liked it, great. Sorry about the rant. It's gonna be the last time. I swear, I promise, cross my heart. Um but I guess I'll see you on the next episode. Bye!